Have you tackled your taxes? That can take a toll. But transforming your teeth doesn't have to be taxing. Dennis Steve Marsh is here with easy fixes that result in a return of a big smile. Thank so you welcome for, back to the show. Thank you for that wonderful introduction. It's cute. So a couple of weeks ago, we featured big jaw-dropping mouth makeovers. But um, today, the trend is more towards non-taxing treatments that make your teeth look terrific, right? Right. So you know, when we did those other, that other segment, um, we showed a lot of big changes, but not everybody needs a big change or wants a big change. Sometimes they have, uh, it can be a financial situation. It could be, well, I need this done because my daughter's wedding is next week and I <laughs> hadn't done it and I wanna see what we can do. So we're able to do some things in a very easy way, uh, non-taxing, so to speak. Okay, so what's the first option? So oftentimes the biggest issue is contouring. Sometimes people's teeth have shifted over time. Uh, and this is a young woman, actually mid-30s, and over time um, her teeth had moved a little bit, and you can see those lower teeth got a lot of wear. And that happens because the lower teeth go up under the upper teeth and sometimes chip. So we literally just reshaped those teeth. We call it contouring. In about 45 minutes, we made those lowers look almost like she just got out of braces, which was what her comment to me was. And on the uh, viewer's uh, left, you can see the, the front tooth, one of the front teeth was shorter. And we actually used some material, some bonding, to make that equal. And she said, my gosh, my head teeth haven't looked like that since I was uh, 14. So wow. what a big change in 45 minutes or so. Absolutely. So what's another easy option? So I mentioned bonding in, in terms of that tooth. And sometimes we do a lot more bonding. And again, bonding is a way we add material or composite to a tooth that's fractured. Um, so we mentioned lower contouring. On the patient, on this patient, we did some lower reshaping. And Lori, this is the daughter of a dentist. Mm. Uh, and uh, she was biting into something. It was sort of hard and fractured. It had always been a little thin. So you see in the before that corner's missing. And right. then again, in about a half hour's time, we were able to reshape the teeth and then add this bonding material. People often ask me, well, can you see the difference between where the bonding is and where the tooth is? What would Absolutely you say? Absolutely not, no. Absolutely not. So if it's done correctly and carefully, you get a great result. I love this picture because I mentioned people coming uh, before a wedding and not giving us much time. <laughs> this is the daughter, or excuse me, the sister of the bride. And she came in, she didn't like the way her teeth had looked. Like the other um, party I had talked about, she also had teeth that had rotated after braces. You know, that's why we tell kids, when you're done with braces, you have to wear your retainer. Not many people do. The ones who do are called women. The ones who don't are called men. <laughs> uh, be that as it may, uh, her teeth had shifted. So we said we can reshape the lowers. And in the upper teeth, we did gum contouring because we wanted everything to look uh, even up on the top. And so we use a diode laser in our office. It takes 15 minutes to make all that tissue look uniform. And then we bonded the teeth. Sometimes, Lori, it takes more than bonding. So this is a patient where we reshape the lower teeth. And if you look very carefully, in the before picture, those two front teeth stuck out. And the two laterals, the two next to the centrals, were back. She said she didn't want all her teeth done. What could we do? We reshaped the lowers. We reshaped the front two. And we took, put, put excuse me, two porcelain veneers on the teeth that sat back. And it looks uniform from the front in a very easy two appointment uh, method. We were able to achieve that. All right. Do we have anything else as far one as last non, one. Yeah, really easy, really non-taxing? Easy, sort of real easy. This patient had lost her front tooth. We put an implant in. We did have to wait four months for the tooth, the bone to integrate. And then we put a crown on that tooth and we did porcelain veneers and some gum contouring. Um, she, we did that when she was 22. She just came back to Cleveland at age 32. She's a nurse and they look very much the same as they did when we did this work uh, over 10 years ago. Quite a difference. So we have lots of options today, uh, small or large, but we can do whatever it takes to satisfy the patient. All right. You know your taxes are due in two days, but what's your deadline for having the smile of your dreams? Don't ask yourself for an extension. Give Steve a call to file for one of these easy fixes. His number's coming up next. See what Dr. Stephen Marsh can do for your smile by calling 440-461-1003 or visit www.clevelandsmiles.com.